Today I'm going to show you how to add pets to the shops in Aux inventory. I'll leave a link to the documentation and other helpful things in the description. I hope you enjoy the video. First, to find the shops, go to your resources and find Aux inventory. Then go into the data folder and open the shops.lua. The shops here are separated based on what they are and what's in them. The first section here for the 24 7s, you can change the blip information and items in the shop at the top, but the focus in this video are for the pets. So use the link in the description that takes you to the documentation. You should already be in the guides section for the shops. I'll mention there are also multiple guides in here if you need them in the future. For this one, it shows multiple ways to set up a shop. So find the one that says shop using a ped and copy it as a template. Then go back to the shops.lua and paste it under the target section. Before I go into changing the ped and such, I will mention you need to have the target enabled in the aux inventory con bar so players can interact with the pet. You can comment out or remove the other preset locations in the target section if you plan on setting up and using a ped for all the shops. If you don't, when players use the target or third eye, there will be two options or labels if the locations are the same or similar. So I'll go ahead and remove the other ones. Now this shop is set up for Innocence, so I'll leave it here and continue using it as a template for another one. You can keep the pad the same or go to the site, find one you like and replace it. So I'll go there and look through the pads. And once you've found one you like, just copy the name, go back to the shops.lua. Highlight the one that's already there and paste what you copied. The scenario is what the pet is doing. I left the link in the description to that site as well if you want to change it. The process is similar. You copy one you like and replace the one in the shops.lua. So I'll go there and cycle through them. Now just use the one where they're holding the phone. The next thing is location, so I'll go in game and choose the spot where I want the ped to be. Once you're there, copy the cords, then go back and replace the ones that are already there. Then go in game again and copy the heading and do the same thing, so go back and replace it. You can repeat this process for the shops until you have it set up like you want. I'll restart and show the changes, but first a quick message. If this video was helpful, consider supporting my work by ordering a VPS or transferring your current one of one of one service using the link below. Created by the team behind Project Soft, one of one service is a top VPS provider for popular 5M servers delivering unmatched uptime and performance. They offer the best DDoS protection, super fast 10 gigabit per second internet speed, and exceptional support via Discord and tickets with 96% of tickets answered in under 30 minutes. With locations in Dallas, Ashburn, Chicago, and Europe, they ensure low latency and top tier reliability. All right, the blip for both the shops are here. And the pet tier as well, but she's floating. If that happens, go back to the shops.lua, find the cores, and lower the third number by one. So I'll go ahead and open the shop, and buy a burger and a water. That's about for this video. If you enjoyed and it helped you out, please leave a like and a sub. If you need help or have any suggestions, feel free to comment down below or join my Discord. The link will be in the description. Thank you for watching.